This looks like a normal bridge. It started here. With collaborative research between NC State University and the North Carolina Department of Transportation. This is very cutting edge technology in, around the country. This is a fairly unique product. And now it's down east. The current Harkers Island Bridge was built in 1969 and is the only way for people to get between the island and the mainland by vehicle. It's not only aging, but it has become increasingly harder for the state to find the materials to properly maintain it. Construction on a new bridge started in 2021 and contractors are using a new material. This particular project is using carbon fiber reinforcing steel as a way to combat corrosion for the coastal environment. It looks real similar to steel, but uh, it's non-corrosive. The only steel that we have in it is in the barrier rail and in the concrete sheet pile wall uh, at the end vents. But as far as your caps, piles, your girders and columns, it's all uh, carbon and glass fiber. The rods are lighter weight and easier for the contractor to handle. So the fiber is laid the same way. If we can get away from steel and use something that's non-corrosive, it'll help with the maintenance, long-term long maintenance, and it'll make the bridge last, last longer. It's better environmentally as well. While this material has been used in other parts of the country, it is the first time it will be featured in North Carolina. It's cool to do, uh, do new stuff, new technology that hasn't been done, uh, been, been the first uh, for this area. Uh, so yes, it's a good learning experience, but like I said, it's something we can use moving forward. And crews say it is already proving to be something that will be used again in the state. We're going to have to learn to work smarter, be innovative, but we also want to be able to be sure that we're capturing some of the wisdom from some of our seasoned employees and make sure that we still understand the why we're doing what we're doing and uh, maintain good stewards for the state of North Carolina.